Hello everybody, this is John with Alarm Lock and NAPCO Technical Support. In this brief video tech tip, I will be discussing this warning uh, upon loading DL Windows 5, uh, where you might see an unable to connect to database. Please verify the following. Uh, if you're experiencing this warning uh, appearing on your screen, if you've been connecting to your DL Windows software and all of a sudden today you log in and you're unable to connect, uh, this is a um, quick thing to check, you know, to verify and make sure that your services are running for a SQL Server. Uh, otherwise, you will get this warning message here. So this is uh, pretty common uh, if your services have been stopped for uh, some reason. Sometimes a Microsoft update or something on your PC may have stopped the SQL Server uh, services. Uh, so in this video, we'll be discussing how to verify that they are turned on. Uh, so you can, uh, the way I like to do is if you just type into your search on a, on a Windows 10, uh, you'll be able just to type in services, and you'll see the application pop up here. And you're going to see all the list of Microsoft services here, and we can press S, and we're going to go down to where it says SQL Server, and we just found our database, ALSQL Express. Um, as you see here, there's a column called Status, and we want to make sure that this column for the database that it is running. So as you see in this case, uh, it is not, it is blank. And also, the second service, is, service that you need to check is SQL Server Browser. So these both services need to be running in order for your DL Windows program to, uh, to connect to your database. Uh, so in this case here, we're going to start them. So you could click right here and press Start This Service. And as you see, it is now running. And we'll do the same thing for SQL Server Browser. Actually, you can actually right-click as well and then press Start. And as you see now, they are both showing running. Uh, just want to note another location where you can start your services. If you can't find your services application on your computer, you can go into uh, SQL Server 2008 and Configuration Tools. And there's a program called SQL Server Configuration Management. Uh, this is a little bit more advanced for those who are very familiar with the manager tool here. And as you see, you know, we have the SQL Server browser, which is running, and the AL SQL Express, which is also running. So this will just mimic the services that we were in uh, previously in your administration tools of your computer. So uh, you can also start and stop these services from here. So in case they are, uh, you are receiving that warning, you can go into the SQL Server Configuration Manager and turn them on in this program here. So at this point, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and reattempt to connect to the DL Windows software. Minimize here. And now we'll launch the DL Windows software. And as you see, I'm now able to access the database. Hope you enjoyed this video tech tip. Again, my name is John with Alarm Lock and NAPCO technical support. Thank you for choosing Alarm Lock and NAPCO. Have a great day. Take care.